Okay. Are the captions working now? Yes, great. Why is the game freezing? Okay, let's get up. Yeah, I still have to get used to this microphone. It's pretty weird. Level up Leo, welcome to the stream. Today is, is the Shade's birthday. It's gonna be due in 21 in-game hours. I'm quite excited, because this is the last achievement I need, except for ending the game. So, quite exciting. Oh, there's no audio on, the, on stream. Now there should be audio. Great. Hong Krosa, welcome to the stream. Today is the Shade's birthday. Hype. Honk, thanks for the honk. Yeah, welcome everybody. Um, so, if I, I, I will get the achievement for the birthday if I just like have the game open once it changes from 35 days to 34 days. But if I stand in a specific spot when that happens, I get a secret crystal. So I'm going to wait until it's like, I don't know, 35 days and maybe one hour left or like half an hour left. And then we're actually going to go to the... To the crystal cave and yes I'm a real streamer now because I have a microphone stand now it looks so professional <laughs> just gonna write a message re real quick yeah how is everybody doing if you want to talk about it of course Yeah, maybe I'm just gonna play some music. Because playing this melody, uh, this one, advances time by 10 minutes. Yeah, right now, um, time is moving pretty fast. Like, we, we skip one minute. Uh, no, uh, yeah, we skip... Wait. Yeah, every two to three seconds, real time, we skip one minute in-game time. So yeah, it should be like, actually, yeah, wait, is, is my math like super off here or is, will 18 hours advance in 9 minutes? I'm not sure. I'm confused. What the heck? Uh, excuse me, what? Why can't I move? 
And where did the instrument go? What the heck is this? Are you fucking kidding me, game? I can't move the shade? The instrument is gone, but time is still going on. What the heck is this? Oh. Okay, I'm gonna restart the game and I hope it's gonna work out. Holy shit. This is making me anxious. <laughs> yeah, I hope so. I, I mean, I hope that it's just uh, gonna be a bug that's, that fixes itself, basically. Because I was looking forward to this birthday secret thingy for like forever now. And if it doesn't work because of a bug, I'm gonna be very sad. Okay, so let's just start up the game again and hope it's gonna work this time. I am very anxious now, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Okay, interesting. That never happened before. Okay, it works again. Nice. I'm glad. <laughs> I really have to sp speak more clearly. For the subtitles. It's just so hard because I have such a bad accent. I mean, it's not too bad, but... It's also not great either, so... <laughs> I'm sure the accent doesn't help. Yeah, I, I could have started the stream a little bit later, so we wouldn't have to wait so long, but... I just wanted to make sure to not fuck it up in this, in some way. Yeah, so... 15 uh, in-game hours to go. But that will pass pretty fast, actually. Uh, like, um... Yeah, one day roughly passes in half an hour, so... Yeah, sadly I have no paper left to draw, so maybe I just show the, the cave a little bit. Because I got quite a lot of stuff here. Ah, we can make a fire to make time go faster. I forgot about that. Yeah, with the microphone stand, it's actually hard to see the buttons of my foot feet controller. <laughs> so that's a little bit annoying. Regular fire. Nice. Yeah, welcome everybody. This is one of this is going to be one of my last streams of, of this game, at, uh, at least for casual playthrough. Afterwards, I plan on doing speedruns. Yeah, currently there is one legitimate speedrun on YouTube of this game. 
I mean, you can speedrun any game if you want to. Um, there are several endings of this game. Um, there, is there are five different endings. And the one I'm doing now, where I awaken the king, is of course the ending that takes the longest time. But there are other endings. Um, there is one ending that is currently used by the only speedrun that exists of this game. The only legitimate speedrun, I should say. Because there is one fake speedrun. <laughs> Um, yeah, in the ending that this speedrun currently uses, the shade commits suicide. And you can actually do that in about two hours. And then there are two endings, uh, um, uh, two endings uh, where the shade actually leaves the cave. Uh, I have no idea how fast you, you can do those. Uh, my estimate would be between three and four hours, but I'm not sure. I actually would like to speedrun one of those endings, because I think the suicide ending is pretty depressing. Uh, although, to be fair, one of the endings where you leave the cave is also depressing. But yeah, uh, pick up the coal. Nice. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put the shade in the bed again. Because we have to pass like 14 more hours. Yeah, but speedrunning this game... Um, to actually awaken the king would take very long. There is one video on YouTube that claims to be a speedrun uh, which is actually a tool assisted speedrun uh, the person uses an external tool to play this melody that I played before with the instrument uh, to continue to continuously play the melody without doing anything themselves and with this technique it takes roughly 40 hours so if you would factor in that if you do this legitimately you would of course have to sleep so it would be far longer probably at least 50 to 70 hours yeah but it's actually sounds like a super boring speedrun because like all you do basically is gather the missing parts of the instrument in the cave and then play the instrument for 40 hours with breaks in between to sleep and that sounds very boring to be honest <laughs> which doesn't mean I don't want to do it but <laughs> Yeah, at some point I would really like to do it. I actually started writing down what I would have to do. Um oh, Zelda White, I thank you so much. You're cute. You're cute as well. We are all cute here. This is the cute club. Yeah, I actually started writing down what I would have to do to 100% this game in a speedrun. <laughs> and it would take forever. I mean, I can bring up the list here on my phone. So, for 100%, what I have written down yet. Yeah, um, it's, it's a lot, actually. Zelda Wilder, how are you doing? If you want to talk about it. We are currently waiting for the Shade's birthday. And when the birthday occurs, I want to be um, at a specific part of the map because then I will get a secret crystal. I'm glad you're fine. I'm... I don't know how I am. I think I'm... Yeah, I don't know. 
Oh yeah, this stream will skip one hour. So we have to make sure not to accidentally skip the birthday with, with a dream. Yeah, I, I, I'm so bored all the time that I actually bought a new game on the Switch. And I played it with my hands and that was a big mistake. And I kind of regret it. Yeah, now we have 11 hours left. I really have to make sure that I don't dream, uh, skip the birthday with a dream. So I have to get up uh, early. This microphone stand still feels weird. <laughs> like, I'm not used to this. And I'm not even sure if it actually improves the audio quality. Like... Ah, uh, I'm not sure. I was hoping that the speech to text would uh, pick up more stuff, I say, and would work better. And I think it does, but I, it's also because I'm try to speak more clearly, so. Oh, so exciting, just 11 hours left. This is exciting, people. We're gonna get the last crystal. Uh, the last large crystal. There are still smaller crystals I haven't uh, harvested yet. Because I don't really see the point since they don't advance time. Like, they, they don't make time go faster. They are just decorative. So I don't really see the point in mining them, because it takes like 10 minutes for each crystal to mine. We got another dream! <laughs> yeah, but like, for 100%ing the game, there's actually quite a lot you would have to do. You would have to collect all the four instrument parts. You would have to collect the horse head, the curtain, the three carpets, four metocs, four red crystals, two blue crystals, six white crystals, one pink crystal, one black crystal, I think around 40 books, one flower, 13 disappointments, and the disappointments are quite quite a thing because there are some disappointments that you can't get after a certain point in the game for example there is uh, there, there are stairs and the stairs have a hole in them so you can't cross over them and if you try to cross over them you get a disappointment but after I think a week or so a, st a stalactite drops from the ceiling and then you can walk over the stairs. So if you don't go there before the, st the stalactite drops, you will not be able to get the achievement, and then you can't 100% the game anymore. At least not according to what I would consider 100%. Yeah, and there, there are just so many things you would have to get and do, and it would take forever. Let's eat some cookies. I hope you have your snacks ready as well if you if you want some. Because what would this game be without snacks, right? Not binary by heart, welcome! Yeah, it's the Shade's birthday. 
You don't. No need to apologize, please. Don't worry about it. There is no Anwesenheitspflicht here, so. Yeah, how are you doing if you want to talk about it? How was everybody's secular new year? Uh, okay, the... no. S secular. Yeah, whatever. The speech to text is kind of weird sometimes. I did not say sexual. I said secular. Now it's got it. It's it's correct. <laughs> yeah, sometimes the speech to text is just very strange. But I'm actually glad to have it now because it improves the accessibility of my stream, and I think that's actually a great thing. Yeah, I saw there is also the possibility to um, have a plug-in so that the captions are displayed like subtitles, L for example, like in Netflix. Um, but I didn't really understand how to set it up. And the thing is, if I upload my videos to YouTube, then those integrated captions would, would be gone. Um, it's actually really easy. Um, the way I do it currently is um, you go to the website called webcaptioner.com and um, then you just make a window capture of the website and then I made the background transparent, which you don't have to do of course, but I think it's nice. So it's basically just a window capture of this website. Yeah, the shade is dreaming. Yeah, I think as soon as the clock shows 35 days, zero hours and like, I don't know, maybe 30 minutes, I'm probably gonna go. Or may maybe 20 minutes, I'm not sure. Yeah, better early than late, because if I'm late, I have to turn back time again. Which actually is a thing in this game. You can time travel backwards. <laughs> New Year's wasn't worth mentioning for me. How about you? Yeah, same. I just streamed. Uh, like, I just had a chill out on stream. I think I'm going to do the Twitch integrated one, just to give people the chance to turn it off if they want. Yes, makes sense. Uh, the cool thing about the integrated subtitles is uh, also you can customize them, so you can change the, the color and I think also the size and the font. So that's actually pretty cool. I'm so excited for the birthday, oh my gosh! Another dream! Yeah, this is a troll. A troll child. My layout is crowded as is, so I don't know where I would put subtitles. Yeah, fair enough. And I mean, if, if you don't put all your streams on YouTube, then I think it doesn't really matter. Like, I upload every stream I do to YouTube, so... <laughs> okay, just four hours to go. 
We we're getting close, people. Honk. Wait, didn't I tell the speech to text to replace H U N K with H O N K? I think I did that. Meow. Yeah, I really have to play, play, pay close attention to the time now, so I don't miss my chance of getting the crystal. I mean, as I said, I can turn back time to get it again, but that would be pretty annoying, I think. <laughs> Honk. <laughs> I don't really like the secular new year, to be honest, because of all the fireworks, it just stresses me out so much. Ah, this is the autosave freeze, the infamous. Every time the game saves, it freezes. And the longer you play, the longer it freezes. Which makes sense, I guess, because it has to save more data. Uh, why is the dream not playing? This is weird. Oh my gosh, the game is breaking. I have too much stuff in my cave. I think I'm gonna restart the game. Just to be sure, because I don't want to miss the birthday. This is really strange and stressing me out quite a bit, actually. I think the problem was that because this game is so long, they couldn't really play test it correctly or e enough. So, yeah, that's an issue. <laughs> I will probably make uh, clips of the, those bugs and post them in the Steam forum. Honk. Yeah, I'm actually gonna get out of bed now, so we don't have the... Uh... We don't risk skipping the birthday with a dream. Let's make another fire. You decorated the shades room really lovely. Oh, thank you. Yeah, funny, <laughs> funny story. I found like this really big picture of the king and I hung it in the bathroom. Because I think that's where royalty deserves to be. <laughs> in the place where you take a shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean the shade 
doesn't actually need to like go to the bathroom but uh, the shade actually called this uh, room downstairs actually called it bathroom so I think it was fitting Oh my god, we are so close to the birthday. Thank you for being here everybody, this is so exciting for me. I'm gonna be so sad when this game is over. Okay, now I'm gonna wait until it shows maybe half an hour and then we're gonna go to this cave here. This is so exciting! Hype indeed! Let's pick up the coal. It's always nice to have some coal. Victory to the miners! <laughs> I mean, speech to text is really hard to make to make good, I think. So <laughs> I always joke that the most unrealistic thing about Star Trek is not like other species or warp drive, it's the perfectly working speech to text. That's the most unrealistic thing about Star Trek in my opinion. <laughs> okay, let's go. I really hope I will get there in 20 minutes, <laughs> but I think it's gonna be fine. I'm not gonna pick up stuff on the way, I'm just gonna walk there to be there in time. Yeah, I think it should be fine. This is such an intense gaming moment for me, like... Gaming moment. I'm probably going to be way too early, but I'd rather prefer that. To being late. <laughs> Shows or movies with universal translators that never malfunction is so far fetched, indeed. <laughs> And I don't just mean uh, translators, I also mean like when, for example, a, a crew uh, member is uh, dictating a letter to the computer and there, there are no mistakes in the letter. I, I was like, yeah, sure. <laughs> I can't believe in warp drive, I can't believe in Klingons, but I can't believe in perfect speech to text. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah, I think it's just super hard to get right because there are so many different accents and pronunciations and stuff like this.
And actually, speech to text has helped me a lot in the last uh, couple of months. Because of my hand injury, I don't really want to type too much. So when I talk to people in chat on my phone, I usually use speech to text. And for the most part, it works pretty okay. And it has helped me a lot. So much gold that nobody needs. Can't we just take all the gold and like distribute it to the people on the surface? Medieval communism presented by the shade. <laughs> Yeah, we are gonna be too early, but it's fine. <laughs> Shade is Robin Hood confirmed. I wish. That would be so cool. <laughs> Just imagine. Nothing ever happens down here. That's not true actually shade Quite a lot has happened. We have uh, we have made a friend Who sadly died lately? We have talked to a face in the wall we have Visited the secret tower we have done so many things Yeah, I want to check on the sp uh, on the, on the spider friend's grave because uh, there's gonna be a flower growing there, and we can actually take the flower home. Excuse me, what? Keep walking. Yeah, this microphone stand actually came with a thingy to hold my phone, and that's really, really useful. <coughs> Lila! Welcome! Welcome to the stream. The birthday is due in 14 minutes. I'm so excited. How are you doing, if you want to talk about it? My mic is übersteuert? Oh. Thank you. I turned it down a bit. I hope it's better now. Honk. I have absolutely no idea, Zelda, who this person is. Okay, welcome to the Crystal Cave. Or the Waterfall Cave, I don't know. Okay, this is where we have to be on our birthday to get a secret present.
So this is where we are gonna wait. For the next 12 minutes. I hope the microphone is better now. German grandma, best grandma. <laughs> yeah, German grandmas, no. Whatever. Yeah, this is a really pretty place. Persona music. Uh, I think I have never really listened to the soundtrack, but I should probably give it a go because if you like it, then it's probably good. Because the music you post in my Discord is always fun and nice to listen to. <laughs> Thank you, Lila, for the heart. I really appreciate it. I think I'm gonna post some hearts as well to celebrate the birthday. You're gonna get all the pride hearts. Thank you. That's my cat, Zoraya. She's currently not in my room. That's why the cat cam is offline. Madame Meow. Exactly. That would actually be a great name for a cat. <laughs> but all the cats I adopted already had names. And I didn't change them, so... The first cat I adopted was named Kitty. My second cat was named Greg. And... My third cat is called... Uh, Zoraya. S O R A Y A. It's so funny how the shade is um, looking out of the water. It looks so funny. Less than 10 minutes, exactly! It's gonna be birthday time soon. Anticipation indeed. Just look how focused the shade is. They don't even follow my mouse cursor anymore, which they usually do. Are there any cool Twitch emotes with like c celebration? What is this? Oh! I actually have an emote that says celebrate. 
Maybe I should spam those when the birthday comes. Yeah, the Shade's birthday is definitely way more interesting than New Year. I totally agree. Six minutes! This is a really ambivalent moment for me because on the one hand I'm really happy to see the Shade's birthday not only because I'm getting a Steam achievement for it lol um, but on the other hand this means the game will be over soon and that makes me really really sad Luckily, I can speedrun this game. <laughs> Five minutes! Exciting times! <laughs> Exciting, okay. We are so close, oh my gosh. I don't want to jinx it, but I'm kind of afraid something will happen, like the game f crashes or something. Please let this just be the autosave freeze, please. Are you fucking kidding me, game? I can't move the mouse? Okay, it was just the autosave, thank goodness. <laughs> I'm too excited. I'm I'm so warm. I have to take off my jacket. Like this is too much for me.
Yeah, I hope it will be all right. Only two more minutes. Get your emotes ready <laughs> to spam the chat and crash OBS and crash the stream. <laughs> actually, is is it actually possible to put so many emotes into OBS that that it crashes? Probably, right? But you would probably need like hundreds of bots spamming the chat. Just one more minute, people. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is such an intense gaming moment. What the heck? <laughs> Why am I so excited for this? I know exactly what is going to happen. 10 seconds, get ready. Today is my birthday, hooray. No, I pressed too late! Are you fucking kidding me? I pressed too late to get the crystal! Oh no! <laughs> I pressed too late! Fuck. Are you fucking kidding me right now? <laughs> this is so funny. This is really funny in my opinion. I mean, it doesn't really matter because I'm not gonna do the secret ending anyway, but it's just like... This is such a loyal moment. Yeah, now we got uh, five blue stones, and with those bl uh, five blue stones, we can turn back time, actually. <laughs> Learn to fly, yeah, good idea. Maybe we could ask the, the bird from the secret tower to, <laughs> to get the crystal for us. For us. <laughs> this is so funny, because I... I, I read in a guide that somebody said you have to press like really quickly and I was like, okay I'm definitely gonna do that and then I just missed it. That's so funny <laughs> This is so funny. I mean this looks nice as well. I'm not complaining I'm, I'm just thinking oh the awakening of the king will be such a joyful moment. I'm sure it will be yeah Tell yourself that. Maybe there is a way to still get the crystal somehow? Or we just have to turn back time. But I, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, for me it doesn't really matter. Because I'm not gonna do the secret ending. But it still sucks in a way. Because I was like, oh cool, I'm gonna get the third big crystal. And now I didn't get it. <laughs> That's really funny in a way. I mean, why would they have this section here if not for getting the crystal?
<laughs> this is so funny. Okay, I totally blew it. Great. <laughs> this is so funny. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's see how long it takes to walk back home. Then we can try out the um, time travel mechanic. I screwed up the most important gaming moment of my life. <laughs> I knew that I had to press pick up instantly and I still didn't do it. This is so funny. I actually want to see if I can get the crystal again if I turn back time and then come back here. So I'm gonna stop the time, how long it takes from here to get home. Okay, bye bye Leela, thank you for, for um, stopping by. Can I say that your positive outlook on the situation is kind of uplifting? I need that energy for 2021. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying my best to stay positive. I mean... What choice do I have in the end, to be honest? Like... I hope you can carry some of that energy with you. Oh, by the way, thanks for all the emotes. I really appreciate it. Like, this was like a really cool birthday celebration. It's just so funny that I I knew exactly what was going to happen. I knew exactly what I had to do and I screwed it up regardless. <laughs> That's basically a very good metaphor for my entire life to be honest. Well, maybe not my entire life, but big, big parts of it. I mean, do I really want to try this again? Like, I'm not sure it's really of any use because I don't want to do the secret ending anyway. I really don't know. I mean, sure, someday maybe I'm gonna do a secret ending speedrun. <laughs> if I ever have a computer that doesn't crash randomly. I mean, just imagine I would do like a secret ending speedrun and it would take like, I don't know, 40 hours and then like right before the end my PC is gonna crash 
and then the run is invalid, that would be so so depressing. Oh, speaking of depressing speedruns, <laughs> I started speedrunning officially in, I think, March of last year. Uh, that's when I submitted my first speedrun to speedrun.com. But then I realized I did a, a speedrun way earlier, I think in January of 2019. I actually speedran a very trashy game called The Stalin Subway um, where you play a soldier in the Soviet Union in the 1950s I believe trying to stop a plot uh, of people trying to murder Stalin and it's a very trashy shooter but it was very fun to play so I wanted to speedrun it and then I actually did a run but I didn't record the run because I was like ah oh, it's going to be bad anyway and I had no idea about speedrunning whatsoever so I just did the run with splits and at the time world record was 50 something minutes and my run was 36 minutes <laughs> So at the time, it would have been the world record, but I didn't record it and I never came back to recording it because the game crashes all the time. And I realized this, I think, yesterday or maybe two days ago. <laughs> and it was so depressing because <laughs> I could have had the world record for this weird, strange game. <laughs> But I screwed it up by not recording, so... Kids, remember... Always record every attempt. Very important lesson for speedrunning. Never speedrun without recording. You are going to regret it at some point. Believe me. <laughs> Yeah, but now the world record is way better because people found out of bounds uh, tricks. Any, welcome! Always be recording. A, B, C. <laughs> Very good. Yeah, Any, we just uh, witnessed the Shade's uh, birthday. But I messed something up, so I didn't get the secret present. <laughs> so now we're going to try to turn back time <laughs> and try again. <laughs> because now I can actually time travel in this game. <laughs> How are you doing if you want to talk about it? <laughs> oh, sorry, this is just so, so funny to me. I'm not sure why. Ah. <coughs> I came to watch the happy mess. <laughs> yeah, it was a mess. I'm okay, you know, you know. Yeah, I know. I mean, being okay is better than being shitty, I guess, so... Yay! <laughs> okay, walking back from the crystal cave to the home takes roughly 8 minutes. So we have to turn back the time to 35 days and 10 minutes. Yeah, I have never uh, used or seen the, the time travel mechanic, so I'm really excited to try it out. 
Apparently you can read books backwards and then time advances backwards. Oh, the fire is still burning. So we have to wait until this fire uh, goes out. Hmm. Yeah, this is my lovely cave. I'm just going to show the cave until the fire goes out. Because I'm sure not all of you have seen everything. First time watching this and it is always that slow obviously. Yes, it is. This is a very slow game. On purpose. Yeah, this is my lovely bed. Made out of moss. And then over here we have the mushroom cave or the mushroom garden. And down here we got the bathroom, which is of course the perfect place to hang the picture of the king. Okay, do we really want to do the turn back time mechanic? I don't know. I think I want to try it. Because I kind of want to do everything in this game. Because I'm low key obsessed with it. <laughs> Maybe even high key, I'm not sure. Yeah, the music uh, comes from those big crystals, by the way. And if you got the third crystal, which I just failed to get, <laughs> and you put them all in one place, you open a secret portal. And if you enter it, you get the secret ending of this game. Okay, the fire is out, so we can now do the time travel fire. Let's try this. Ooh, this looks cool. What the heck? This looks very cool. Holy shit. Okay, let's read a book to advance the time travel. Is this actually working? Uh, no, it's not. Okay. Okay, somebody said that the books can actually advance the time travel. It is? I don't know. Oh! Oh, okay! Okay, nice! I didn't realize this. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, but, but the game is fr uh, freezing right now. 
Okay, 14 minutes, so... Yeah, actually, let's wait until it shows 11 minutes and then go back. Oh no, wait! I jumped back a whole day? Oh no! I jumped back a whole day! I only wanted to jump back like, I don't know, half a day. No, actually less. Oh. I just mess up everything right now. This is so funny. Okay, so let's play some music. Uh, okay, like... <laughs> Just to make this clear, to advance one hour you have to play the instrument 144 times. Uh, no, no, for, for one day. Yeah, for one day, 144 times. Six times for an hour. So, 20 times six is... Uh, 120. Easy. This is the most chaotic uh, stream I ever did in this game. And I kind of love it. No, wait, wait. I'm, I'm totally wrong with, with, with the numbers. To advance, like, you have to play fo Wait. Yeah, okay. You have to play the four notes six times for one hour. Why did, did the time turn back so, f so much? I only skipped like a couple of pages. Yeah, this is what you would have to do for most of the speedrun. If you would do the Awaken the King ending, you would do this for 40 hours. Um, we made a blue fire, and the blue fire turns back time. And I'm doing this because I failed to pick up the crystal that you get on your birthday if you are in a specific spot. At exactly midnight. So I'm turning back time to collect the crystal. Which is good for you because then you get to see the birthday as well. <laughs> and everybody else gets to see it twice even. Isn't this great? Yeah. 
double birthday indeed. You know what I just re realized? We could turn back time and make our spider friend live again. But if we want our spider friend to never die, we can never wake up the king. This is so sad. By the way, you also do this uh, music playing for quite a bit in the any percent speedrun or the suicide ending speedrun. And you would also have to do it quite a bit in the good and bad ending speedrun. Actually, you have to do this in any speedrun of this game. Unless, of course, you run dungeon percent. <laughs> because there is actually a dungeon in this game that where you can get locked up. If you um, play this game and then you advance your uh, computer clock, the game actually registers that and puts you in a prison. And to get out again, you have to repent by clicking a button for 400 times. This is really hard to do this like all the time. I really don't understand why it skipped so much time at once. Okay. The cat destroyed a plant. I knew I should have stopped at 22. Fucking hell. Wow, this is really a chaotic stream. <laughs> <laughs> now we can look how the mechanic actually works. So let's do it again. What the heck? I'm. S uh. Okay, let's just skip one page. One page. We are at 34, 23, 58. Let's skip one page. How much did that skip? I have I don't really understand this. Oh wait, D did this skip one hour instead of one minute? I think it actually skipped one hour. D did somebody pay attention? It's, it's still going up. Okay, now it's going down again.
Yeah, let's go out at, I don't know, 20. I mean, no, actually 12 minutes will be fine, I think. I'm not sure, but I think it skipped one hour per page. Which is quite a lot, actually. If, if that's actually the case. Okay, let's try again. <laughs> I'm actually gonna go refill my water, so see you in a bit. A dear friend of mine is joining me. <laughs> Wait, can I actually put her on the microphone stand? I can't put her on the microphone stand, what the heck? Look at this. Why did the shade stop? Please continue walking. We have to get a crystal. I'm actually surprised it's uh, the the stand is holding the weight of the plushie. I mean, it's not the most heavy plushie in the world, but still, I'm quite impressed. Okay, let's see if we can actually get the crystal this time. <laughs> I was MIA and thought I was missing, but it hasn't happened yet, has it? Um, what are you exactly talking about? Um, we actually turned back the, the time. But I turned it back way too much. Because <laughs> I thought uh, one page of a book would skip time like one minute, but I think it was actually one hour. So I was at 36 days again. And I had to play the instrument for five minutes.
Somebody in the Steam forum speculated what happens when you turn back the time uh, below. No, uh, above 400 days. Sorry to hear that, but good for me since I was called away for a short time. Yeah, great, great timing actually for everybody. And uh, yeah, my my uh, good Pokemon Eevee joined me. <laughs> no! Oh my gosh, Eevee fell down. Please, don't. She's alright, don't worry about it. <laughs> Yes, indeed. Very lovely company. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I think you really have to spam the key to pick up stuff to get the crystal. I'm still waiting for the shade action figure to come out. And that's not even a joke, there is a figurine of the shade that will be available hopefully soon. But it got delayed. Probably because of the pandem pandemic. I'm gonna go close my window again because it's getting cold. Really good to know I can put plushies on my microphone stand. <laughs> yeah, so we have to wait five minutes again, but yeah, I, I guess it's gonna be fine. Whee! Okay, the water is back. That's a good sign. Yeah, five minutes is nothing in this game. <laughs> ah, I want to be right in the middle. And now we wait again. Exciting times! The hype is still there, indeed, yes. 
The hype is real. If I am actually getting the crystal this time, I think I'm gonna check if the flower has grown. It's kind of sad that the water goes away after the birthday because I really like this waterfall. <sighs> yeah, one and a half minutes. Get ready again <laughs> for the second birthday of the day. <laughs> One minute to go, and then it's birthday again. Yay! <laughs> I'm gonna spam the, the pickup key. To make sure I'm actually gonna get the crystal this time. Ten seconds. I got it. What a nice birthday present from the king. Wait, the water is not going away now? Is this that correct? Ah, okay. Ah, okay, 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 interesting. Wait! You can get more blue stones this way? What? What the shit? Are you kidding me right now? I thought you could only get the five and that they would never, uh, you would never run out of those. What? I'm so good. Yeah, th thank you for all the emotes and all the hype. Uh, I'm just really confused right now because, like, I was thinking, oh, are there going to be more blue stones? But then I was like, why would there? They, you, you like, you, you can use them infinitely. So wh why would there be more? But there are more blue stones now. <laughs> thank you so much, everybody. Okay, now we're gonna check on the flower. Uh, yeah, this is a good shortcut. No, not shortcut, bookmark. Yeah, I'm not sure why I would want to have more than te uh, five blue stones. Uh, five, yeah. But I'm not complaining. <laughs> okay, is there anything left to do except draw all the pictures? 
I mean, there are 220 pictures. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to draw all of them. Um, yeah, there is the... Um, the portal we can make now with the three big crystals. But I might not make the portal because I'm afraid I I would accidentally enter it and trigger an ending I don't want because I really want to have the Awaken the King ending. Yeah, now all the stress is over and we can finally go back to just walking silently. No more stress. I mean, I could make more moss carpets. Yeah, and we actually got the achievement. Birthday. Let's see how many players actually got this achievement. I'm really curious. Global achievement data. 6.1%. That's the least... Uh, like, the rarest achievement of this game. What? Why? And only 20% of players have completed the game in any way. Like, any ending. 2 Maybe I should I, I kind of want to check on the on the grave, but I'm also very tired right now even though it has only been one and a half hours Yeah, I think I kind of want to check on the on the flower Yeah, Steam achievements are really interesting uh, sometimes because <laughs> There are so many games where you get an achievement for I don't know Finishing the tutorial or finishing the first level and so many people don't even get this achievement Like for example in Subnautica there is an achievement for jumping into the water for the first time and I think Maybe 40% or 30% of players never did this, which means that quite a lot of players n who own Subnautica never actually played the game. This game is gonna be over soon. What the heck? At my current rate of time progression in the living room, I skip two days per hour, which means I only have like 17 real time hours to go until the timer is at zero. So that's tomorrow. 
I can end this game tomorrow. What the heck? When did I actually start streaming this? Let's see. Uh... Okay, my first stream of this game was at the beginning of December. So this took me roughly one month to complete. Yeah, that fits with uh, descriptions of other players. Who put time and effort in. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna check if the flower has grown and then I'm gonna go home and end the stream. Yeah, there is actually now somebody streaming this game 24-7. And another person wants to complete this in real time. So that's exciting. It's really amazing how much this game has touched me. I still can't believe this is gonna be over tomorrow. It's so weird because the whole time at the beginning you are like, you're so focused on getting to the end, but then you, you learn to appreciate the waiting and all the little things you can do in the game. And then when you're close to getting to the end, at least I actually get sad because the longing will be over. I mean, the achievement for completing fire splitter welcome welcome to the stream uh, we just witnessed the shades birthday two times <laughs> because the first time i missed to pick up the crystal that you get yeah i'm gonna be done to tomorrow probably um yeah and it's making me really sad on one hand. On the other hand, it means I can speedrun the game now. <laughs> I 
Yeah, right now I'm gonna go see if the flower has grown. And then I'm gonna head back and end the stream. How is the speech to text working? I would say at least 75% of the time it's working pretty good. Maybe even more, I'm not sure. Sometimes it does really strange things that don't make any sense. But if I speak clearly, then most of the time it's actually very, very good. Yeah, I would say it's more than 75% accurate. I mean, sometimes it doesn't record a word or two, but mostly it's pretty fine. <sighs> oh, the flower has grown from the grave of our spider friend. Let's take a moment of silence to remember the only friend we ever had, the spider friend. A flower from my friend's grave. It will be my most valuable possession from now on. That makes sense. The spider is the only friend we have ever known. And now they are gone. Very sad. But such is life. Okay, I'm gonna go home and place the flower in a nice spot and then I'm gonna send you over to somebody else or just end the stream. I'm not sure. We will see who is online. Of course, if you want to, feel free to to tell us how you're doing, everybody. I'm actually very tired because this whole crystal time travel thing was very stressful. <laughs> I think this was the most stressful thing I have ever done in this game. We are actually gonna be done tomorrow. I can't believe it. <laughs> and it's incredible how sad this makes me. I'm not sure when was the last time a video game has actually made me feel s so much. It is truly a work of art, in my opinion.
I need to eat something, but I have no idea what to eat. Well... I always eat the same thing every day. <laughs> like, for weeks I eat the same thing, and then I get tired of, the, of this thing, and then I eat something else for, for weeks, and then I get tired again. Agreed. Although I have missed quite a big chunk of gameplay, it was still a very wonderful experience in my opinion. Yes, indeed. I mean, if you want to, you can watch all my streams on YouTube of this game. This is the 11th uh, stream now. And all the other 10 are on YouTube. Which you can find here. Link in the chat. I mean, it's gonna be very long. <laughs> if you want to watch all of it, I think it's gonna be something with like 30 hours or... I'm not sure. My current playtime of this game is... let's see... Forty-two hours in total, but I had the game open quite a lot today and yesterday, so I wouldn't miss the birthday. I was really anxious about that. So I just had it run in idle mode um, for maybe ten hours. So, yeah, the whole stream is probably gonna be around 30 hours. But the good thing with the recording is you could always skip the boring parts. Or the parts where, where I forgot to turn on my microphone. Because <laughs> that actually happened to me once. For the first half hour of the stream, my microphone was off. And I didn't realize, and nobody told me because nobody was watching. That was quite unfortunate. I have actually seen quite a lot of Let's Plays of this game on YouTube. I mean, not like all of them, but I've seen that many people have done that. And they have... I, I think people actually put very much love into this game, it feels like. I mean, this is a game where you really get to create a connection with your character. And I think it is not despite, but because of the slow gameplay. You really get attached to this tiny little creature.
I think I'm not gonna do a raid today. I'm I'm so tired and stressed. I think it's gonna be too stressful. But if you're looking for something to watch, you can always uh, watch AGDQ, because that's going on right now. That's fine, I think we all understand. Thank you! <sighs> Hopefully you'll get good rest. I hope so too. I'm probably gonna make some food later. The same as the last weeks, of course. <laughs> Although, to be fair, I had one other type of meal lately. It was very exciting to eat something else for once. <laughs> Sleep well if you will sleep. Yeah, I'm usually I don't go to, to bed this early, so but sometimes I take naps during the day. you my my dear Pokemon don't worry the awakening is imminent soon the king will rise in all his glory yeah we'll see about that I guess I need to start exercising, I feel. I feel like I can much easier take a nap if I have exercised and I feel more able to do stuff in general. Sounds good. Like, if it, if it helps you, go for it. But I do not want to leave my house. Yeah. Oh, look, the green crystal and the flower. Oh. Do I leave the flower there? I'm not sure. Where do I put the green crystal? Maybe here. I don't know, should I put the flower next to my bed maybe? Yeah, I have a lot of stuff. I, I can show the whole cave if, if you want to. I don't like that the flower covers up the stone, so maybe put it here. Can we actually interact with the flower? Let's see. Yeah, let's make a regular fire. Yeah, I want to see if I can interact with the flower. No, don't pick it up, please. For God's sake. Yeah, I think I cannot interact with the flower. It's just... Uh, yeah. Okay. Then I guess I'm gonna send the shade to bed. Because, yeah, I actually have a bed. And a mushroom garden. <laughs> I 
go to bed. Okay, I will probably stream the end of this game tomorrow, I think. So I guess I will see you then if you if you want to and if you have the time. Um, yeah, thank you so much for being here everybody and thanks for all the birthday hype. And yeah, have fun doing whatever you're planning to do now. Thank you so much. Bye bye!